Okay, so you now you see that we're now we're in part two of timing without resources by using the sync time drift to now TX in down in the bottom right hand corner of the screen right now we have gotten so the average signal is minus 1299 minus 1299 so we're in the ballpark we're picking up a lot of signals now and we're minus 1299 or minus 1300 in fact there's a minus 1100 so let's call it minus 1200 okay okay so we go down to the time drift number that time drift number is a what would you call that an absolute it's it's really meaningless uh, but it can be work you, you can work with it okay and believe it or not I found out that you can you can change your keyboard to make it work so we're minus 1200 we want to increase our timing so we want to move it up to to 7200 milliseconds that's positive 7200 milliseconds from 6000 believe it or not I found out that all you have to do is push the up key on your keyboard so you push up and it's moving up okay so now it's 7200 milliseconds so now if we push control or we just push at uh, push uh, heartbeat send out a beacon signal and signals will come in hopefully there's one it's a response to the heartbeat I just sent and what is that one going to be there it is right there it is 100 milliseconds so we've gone from 1200 milliseconds average to 100 milliseconds and that may not be an average but it's not bad it's close enough so now without any internet without I don't even have power I have no internet uh, I can time my JSA uh, station and get on and I started in part one not even being able to pick up anything so I had to use that sync time drift to now TXN that you have to you go to view and tell them you want to view that your, your time drift stuff you also also have to uh, on with your mouse click in uh, this black area here click in that black area and tell it tell it that you with with the mouse right click and you tell it that you want to view time delta so that you turn the time delta column on I like to have all my columns on okay so so we've we've now got 100 milliseconds from 1200 from, actually we have from nothing to 1200 to 100 so we're really in the ballpark now most computers will drift with time they'll drift with time if you don't have internet your computer's gonna drift with time like hours with hours of time it will drift and you have to re reset it using the the uh, the one the, this the, the number way down at the bottom of your screen